What's up guys, Legend here, and today we're going to take a look at the Claw Grip. This grip might seem weird to some people, but personally, I've used this grip since 2014, and I gotta say, it's definitely worth trying out. So let's get into why you would use this grip in the first place. Compared to a standard grip, the first thing you can tell about the Claw Grip is the use of the pointer finger over the button pad instead of using your thumb. So basically, the point of the grip is to allow the use of the right stick, button pad, and trigger all at the same time without interruption. For example, here's what using a standard grip looks like when having to reload while spinning. You can see some minor stops in the movement due to the fact that your thumb has to move from the right stick to the button pad and then back. But if you look at the claw grip in this circumstance, the movement never stops because the thumb never has to move over due to your pointer finger taking care of that button click for you. Now I know a lot of people have different control setups, whether it be standard controls or custom, so what you personally use on the button pad may be different. Personally, my right stick button is my equipment, X is reload, A is jump, B is crouch, and my right bumper is melee. You might think that this setup is pretty weird, but this actually allows me to seamlessly perform tech slides, all while being able to move and melee smoothly at the same time. Because my crouch and jump button are right next to each other and don't get confused with other fingers or buttons. You don't have to use my setup for claw grip if you don't want to, it's just what works best for me personally based on my playstyle. So do whatever is comfortable for you. But overall, the point of the claw grip is to allow seamless gameplay between using the right stick, button pad, and bumper or trigger all at the same time with no stops, no matter the setup you choose to have. So I would recommend practicing or trying this grip if you haven't, because I've seen a huge improvement in the plays I've been able to make since using this grip, and it really allows me to push the limits of what I can do all at the same time. Anyway, that's all for today, guys. Check out my second channel, Legend Clips, to see my funny moments and epic plays, like this moment where we were able to successfully get the entire team to start teabagging. I hope you enjoyed the video. Click the like button and subscribe with the bell icon right next to it to keep up with my videos, and I'll see you guys in the next one.